Hey guys, it's David. Today we're going to go over the hotkeys on this dual monitor KVM. So today we have the MacBook as input 1, 2 is empty, 3 is one of the Windows computer, 4 is another Windows computer. So just like the other KVMs, you double tap the scroll lock key or the right control key to trigger the hotkey feature. So scroll lock 3, switch to the third input, Windows computer, double tap the scroll lock, 4, get to the fourth input, which is the other Windows computer. Pretty much the same as the other dual, dual monitor KVMs. You can mute the buzzer using scroll lock, scroll lock F11. I actually like to have it on. You can change the scroll lock key to right control if you need to by using scroll lock, scroll lock F11, F1, my bad. Now you have right control as the trigger, pretty much the same as the other dual monitor KVMs. Now the main difference on this KVM is that to get into mode two, you have to use the front panel or the remote. Right now we have the MacBook computer and if you want to have the Windows computer up top to view it, you would have to choose output B, which is the top monitor, and then choose one of the inputs. So output B, then four, give it a second. There you go. I'm controlling the top monitor, which is one of the Windows computers. Now, if I want to control the MacBook, I just double tap Alt. Now I'm on the MacBook. If I want to if I want to swap the screens, I just have to choose the correct input and output. So output A, I'm going to choose the Windows computer. So A4, output B, I want the MacBook. So B1, give it a second. There you go. I'm controlling the MacBook up top. Double tap Alt. Now I'm in the Windows computer down below. You can't transfer files between the computers. We get that question every once in a while, but you can view them at the same time. That's how you control the hotkeys on this four input dual monitor KVM. That's all folks.